Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Allie, and today we are going to be doing an update for the Throwback 30 Project Pan. Um, my videos are totally sporadic. I'm doing my best to make sure I stay on top of them. I think I'm doing relatively good. I have all of the rest of the year planned out, like to a T, what video I want to post on what day, and the day I need to record it to make sure it goes up in time. I'm going to do my best for the rest of the year to see if I can follow something like that by planning it. Hopefully I can, because that'll help me next year. Um, so let's just kind of get on in. I do have two empties, um, which is super exciting. I didn't get as much progress on the items that I was working on this um, through this project as I wanted to this month, because I was really focusing on some of my other projects that are ending, or that I kind of want to just like get those products out. So starting with my um, Alamar Cos excuse me, Alamar Cosmetics um, birthday suit lip gloss. I will put all the notes up here for what the project is, what the prompt is, what my goal was, and all that jazz. Um, my goal is to finish this. I know that off the top of my head. My goal is to finish this. I have used this total nine times, but this month I have used it twice. I don't have as much progress. I am not able to draw a new line. I find myself I haven't been reaching for my glosses lately. Um, that's okay, I got at least until July next year to get this finished. So I'm not too worried about the progress on this at the moment. So I've only used it twice this month for a total of nine times. Next is my Illuminati Electric Pink Gel Liner. I believe my goal is 10 uses, I think. Um, I have used this a total of three times, but I did not use this at all. Um, this update this month, I just been fully so like solely focusing on my liners and my Pan of Dinosaurs project, um, and then I have a black liner that I've just been like wearing constantly. So this one hasn't gotten any use moving forward. So I still have a little bit of use to get this before I can meet my goal. Next, we have my Morgan Taylor. Uh, Mistress of Mayhem nail polish. This my goal is to finish and because I have a polish that I'm working on in my Pan Wet May I have not been using this at all. So I didn't use it at all this month but I've used it a total of five times. Um, I've been focusing on the polish that I'm currently wearing which is in my Pan Wet May project. I just said that. But that project ends next month and this will become my sole focus um, polish. I have not pulled in that I know of that I, that I can remember and at this time um, any other polish, polishes to work on in projects so this will be the only polish that I am actually working on for a project pan. Um, my goal is to finish this. I just kind of want to see what I can do and like how long it actually takes me to finish a full nail polish. Brand new. Had never used it before. I really do love this color and I can't wait to actually get more use out of it. Next we have my Essence Shine 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 Clear Gloss. I believe this is in um, Behind the Bleachers. I'm not sure. And my goal is to finish this as well. I have only used this five times this month for a total of 52 uses. Again, I cannot make a new line. I haven't used it. Well, I can, but it's going to be very, very, like, right below the current line. So there's no point in making a new line, um, in my opinion. Um, so this one still has a lot of ways to go. I love this gloss. It's super nice. I've bought multiples of this gloss in different colors. So I can't wait to get this finished up by next July. Next we have my J Cat Loose Glitter. This is in the shade Royal Highness. My goal I think is to use this 10 times. I'm not sure. I'll make sure I leave it up here. Um, I haven't used it uh, I haven't used it at all this month, but I've used it once total. I know it's rough. Um, I've only used this one time, so I still have a little bit of ways to go to get it used up to where I want to meet my goal. But I didn't use it at all because I just wasn't really doing glitter. Next we have my Maybelline Cheek Heat Liquid Blush. This is in the shade Nude Burn. Um, my goal is to use this 10 times. I have used this a total of 5 times and I used it once this month. 
I'm actually wearing it today as well, which will count towards next month's <laughs> um, update. Uh, but I'm just wearing it under my current blush that I'm wearing as well. I really do enjoy this, um, which I didn't think I would. It's kind of sheer, so it blends away relatively quickly. So I tend, I, I notice that I'm using it a lot of it to use it. So I kind of wonder how much more I have left before I can finish it. We will see. We will see. Then we have my L'Oreal Infallible Box of Chocolates, or Box O Chocolate Liquid Lipstick. I'm wearing this today with the um, Essence Gloss on top. My goal, or my total uses is five, and I've used this one time this month. Uh, I really do enjoy this. This is a great fall color. I love the way it smells. It still smells like chocolate, and it is one of my go-to nude type shades. Next we have my Makeup Revolution Renaissance Flick Liquid Black Eyeliner. I don't have a goal for this, I just want to use it for the length of the project before it dries out. I've had this for at least two years. It still hasn't dried out at all. Friend, it's uh, still, all it's right. good. You um, hear talking cool. in the background, that's my husband playing video games with his friends. Um, but what? I don't have a goal. Um, I have used this a total of 11 uh -huh. times and I've used it three times this month. So, I haven't been really wearing a lot of liquid eyeliner because my eyes with allergies have been watery lately, like overly watery, but I just want to make sure I get some use out of it over the year because when, or over the project, because when this is over, the project's over, I'm going to be throwing this away. Just in case. Okay. Next we have my Makeup Forever Wherever Walnut Lip Liner, and look at this tiny thing. Look at it. Okay. It's getting to the point to where it's very hard to sharpen, like very hard. Um, and if I can't sharpen it, then I'm going to call it an end or like a, a finished product or if the pencil itself comes out. My goal is to finish this or not be able to like use it again. I've used this a total of 14 times with a total of seven uses this project or this month, this update stumbling so I'm just trying to get through this. Um, I am wearing it today underneath that liquid lip. Um, I really do love this. This is one of my favorite right lip liners there. and I will probably buy this again um, once I kind of worked through a couple of the other shades that are similar and the other liners I have. Next we have my Pacifica Everyday Lotion um, SPF 30. My goal is to finish this. I have used this a total of 36 times and this month I have used it six times. I, I am really bad about putting SPF on. Um, I, don't, I can't even make a new line. Like it, it would be right below the same line. I find that I am not, I'm not reaching for it. I, I don't know. I'm, I'm sleeping in lately and I'm just not getting up as early as I normally would to be wearing makeup every day. Or I'm, this isn't just what I reach for because my tinted moisturizer has SPF in it. So I don't reach for it. My husband is staring at me opposite side of the camera. Hi. So this is staying in. Stop looking at me. You're making me nervous. Next, I have my Laneige Bay. Next, I have my Laneige um, Lip Sleeping Mask in Mint Cocoa. My goal is to finish this. I have used this a total of 28 times with eight uses this month. I, I have been reaching for a lip balm um, versus a lip mask. I'm not 100% sure why, I just, I have, I have a lip balm that I've been just reaching for because I can put it on multiple times at night. This one I find that my hair sticks to at night um, when my hair is down. So I don't know, I just, I haven't been reaching for this either. It's kind of frustrating because these, I don't know, expiration dates. It says 2023, but I'm not sure. So. This is going to be in here a little bit longer. I still have a lot of product left and not much I can do there. 
Next, I have my Morphe X Jeffree Star um, Red Rum Mini Lipstick. My goal, I think, is 10 times, and I have not used this once at all. I haven't used it at all this month. I haven't used it all this project, and it's kind of frustrating. Um, I want to say this is one of the few items that I haven't used at all in, like, all of my projects, because at least I think I've used everything once in all my projects. Um, I haven't used this at all. I'm thinking when it gets closer to Christmas, I'll be wearing red more, because I wear red lipstick a little bit more then. But I don't know, something about, something about this. I just haven't been reaching for it. So this is going to stay in again. Not rolling out. Yep. Next we have my um, Bath & Body Works Twisted Peppermint Lotion. My goal is to finish it. Um, I have used it a total of 17 times with 7 times this month. And it is finished. So completely empty. It's gone. I'm super excited. I finished this way sooner than I thought I would, which is super cool. I love the way this smells like old lady butt cream and like sugar and Bengay, but I the formula I could tell was like getting a little old because it was more of a liquidy lotion, like soupy versus like a thicker formula it was it was very very watery so it was hard to get up there in age to where it made me wonder if it was going bad but it is finished so i'm super excited to have an empty next we have my super shock shadow in sailor my goal is to hit pan on this i have used this a total of seven times with two uses this update i'm nowhere near hitting pan i've been using this as a eyeshadow topper at the current moment so i have a lot of work to go to hit pan on this one it's a beautiful shade. It's got like a, a pinkish blue reflect. Let's see if y'all can see that. It's a beautiful color. I just haven't been reaching for it. Again, I've been focusing on other shadows. But yeah, so this is going to be staying in for a little, a lot longer, a lot longer. Next, we've got my L'Oreal Infallible Paints Metallics in Rose Chrome. My goal is to hit paint on this as well, and then it's like such a, you, you, a enormous goal for this because this is an embossed type um, eyeshadow. I've been using this as a highlighter. I have used this a total of six times with three uses this month. Again, this is such a beautiful shade. I really do enjoy it, but I've been using it more as a highlighter than as a eyeshadow. There it is as well. Just right underneath Sailor. I really do love it, but I have a lot of work to go if I want to hit pan on this at all. Next we have my shade Mary in my JSC Morphe palette. Um, my goal is to hit pan on this. I have used this um, once this month for a total of three times and this is what that shade looks like. I have been wearing this as a blush. That is how I've been using it because it is a pressed pigment. So I have not been using this on my eyes um, but it is very pretty. And that is what it looks like right above that sailor shade again I've been wearing this as a blush versus an eyeshadow because it is a pressed pigment and I find my eyes get a little irritated with reds it's a beautiful shade my goal is to hit pan which I think I can hit pan relatively quickly because I'm using it as a blush but maybe not because I'm using it as a total as a whole um, for the pan versus just in a singular spot Next is the shade Howler, which is from my um, Gryffindor Mini Ulta palette. It is this shade right here, this matte deep red shade. I believe my goal is to hit pan on this. I have used this um, a total of two times, but I have not used it at all this month. Let me find a spot that I can swatch. 
it does not swatch very well but it blends really well and that is what it looks like nice. it's a beautiful deep red shade but I don't have enough progress on it to hit paint so it's gonna stay in a little while longer next is my LMS dynamic resurfing facial pads uh, my goal is to finish these I have used these a total of 30 times um, with seven uses this month. There are 60 pads in here, but I had used these prior to the project, so I'm not 100% sure how many uses I actually have left. Um, I will find out because I know it's not a full 60. But these are still, I still have maybe 20 or so left. Um, at least 20, I think. Uh, but yeah, so these aren't going anywhere either. I was really hoping to have these done by like now like I was thinking like six months or three two three months would be enough to get these finished but I haven't been using these I don't use an exfoliant every single time I wash my face these aren't going anywhere next we have the um, Becca lilac geode highlighter my goal is to hit pan another astronomical goal um, I have used this a total of five times which two with two uses this month and I will give you a swatch. Figure out where to swatch it. And this is what it is right here. It reminds me of that rose chrome shade. They look very similar. So I've been rotating between them as a highlighter. Which is why neither one of them have a lot of uses. So goal is to hit pan. I still have a little bit of ways to go. Some of these I do know the actual goal off the top of my head because they're the same for more for the majority of the products. Next, we have my ColourPop Glass Bowl Single. My goal is to hit pan on this. I have used this a total of three times with one use this month, and this is what it looks like super pretty give you guys a swatch do it like this is <laughs> like it actually get it on my finger because I'm gonna swatch it on my other hand and this is what it looks like it's kind of this purple with like some blue and some green reflect really pretty again my goal is to hit pan so I have a little ways left to go, or a lot of ways left to go, because I'm nowhere near hitting pan at this time. And next we have my Urban Decay Naked Honey in the shade Honey. My goal is to hit pan again. It is this shade right here. That bright gold yellow honey shade. I have used this a total of seven times with four uses this month. Still no pan, but I've been focusing right there on that outer edge. This is what it looks like. Just a beautiful yellowy golden shimmer metallic shade. So this will be staying in again just a little while longer so I can hit pan. I think maybe another 16, 17 uses. I'm thinking by 30 uses I should be able to have pan. Um, but we will see because this was brand new when I pulled it in. All right. Next we have my Modern Renaissance from ABH palette. I already had pan in two shades. My goal is to hit pan in half of the palette. So that is seven shades. And so I have sh pan in tempera and cypress umber. So for um, golden ochre, I've used it a total of three times. I've used it once this month. For vermeer, I've used it a total of seven times, but I've used it five times this month. Um, Boo on fresco, which I think is going to be the one I hit pan in next. I've used it a total of 13 times and I've used it 11 times this month. 
antique bronze i've used it a total of 10 times and i've used it eight this month i think this will be another one i hit pan on um next um love letter i've used a total of zero times at all i haven't used it at all at all in this project um raw sienna i've used a total of once and i used it once this month burnt orange i've used a total of once and i haven't used it at all this month primavera i have used it a total of seven times I've used it five times this month. I think this will be another shade I will hit pan on relatively soon. Red Ochre, I've used three times and I've used it once this month. Venetian Red, I have not used at all. Warm Taupe, I have not used at all. And Real Gar, I have used once, but I didn't use it at all this month. So I think because I'm trying to pan half, I think Primavera, Bon Fresco and Antique Bronze will be the three shades I have best chance of hitting pan on, as well as Vermeer. And I've really been enjoying this red ochre shade. So if I can hit pan on this little quint right here in the center, that'll meet my goal on this palette. Next we have my ABH Contour Kit, the light to medium. My goal is to hit pan on half of the shades another gigantic goal um, and I'm working right just on this top row right here so on vanilla I've used 11 times I've used it five times this month for fawn I've used it six times total with twice this month um, this is the only bronzer I'm currently working on or contour because the other two bronzers I had in projects have panned in them so they've been rolled out and so now I'm working solely on this one and then Sand, this highlighter shade, I've used it three times, but I have not used it at all this month at all. Next, we have my ColourPop Singles. And... I how to do this. I have used this shade right here, none. I haven't used it at all. I haven't used um, this one at all. Wait, no, hold on. Let me rewind. So this shade right here in the center, Paper Tiger, I have used a total of one times with no uses this month. This glitter right here, I have used one time with a one use this month. I have not used this one at all. I have not used this one at all. I have not used this one at all. I used this one time, but I didn't use it this month. So I've only used a few shades one time total. Um, so I do have some uses to go on this one. Each shade I do want to use 10 times. I know that off the top of my head. Lastly, we have my little samples that I am working on. First, we have my um, Daily Micro Exfoliant Dermalogica, the powder. I've used this a total of twice, but I've used it once this month. There's a lot left in here. You don't need a lot. Um, just a little bit goes into your hand. Mix it with some water. It makes a paste. Wipe it off. Or wash it off. Whatever. Um, so this is going to be in here for a little while. Next we have my Laneige Water Bank Moisturizer. I've used this a total of 25 times um, with 9 uses this month. And this is still going. There's a lot left, but it's not a lot at the same time. This is what it looks like. A little goes a long way, so I find that I'm not using this a lot at once. Um, I'm thinking maybe five, ten more uses, and this should be done. So hopefully next update, this will be empty. Then we have my First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream. I've used this a total of four times, but I've used it once this month. This is what I'll be using once the other one is finished. Um, this is just for a, a, a um, intense hydrating moisturizer. Uh, so I haven't been reaching for this very much. Lastly, we have my Mario Badescu um, Witch Hazel Lavender Toner. I've used this a total of 13 times, and I used it 9 times this month, and this is empty. Finally empty. 13 uses, and it's gone. Um, I really did like it. I am working on the spray, the facial mist in another project. Uh, so yeah. We'll see how I like that one, um, but this is empty, so super excited. This is my second empty this month. And that is going to be it for today's update. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up. I will see you guys 
next month.